Hi guys, this is Jessica from Troop Support, and today I'm going to show you how to make your own maracas. Uh, maracas are a musical instrument that are usually found in different types of Latin and Caribbean genres of music. Um, generally they have handles and you play in a pair, um, but for our maracas that we're going to make today are DIY ones. Um, I'm going to show you how to make some from some items that you might have around your house. So for the inside of the maraca, you just need something that is going to give you like a nice shaking sound. So I had some uncooked white rice, I have some beads, and then really for the outside, you just need anything that's sealable. So I had a couple of old um, empty Easter eggs lying around. You can use an empty bottle and cut this off, paint it, decorate it, and then also you could even use an old toilet paper roll um, just as long as you seal both ends. This would totally work too. All right, so my first egg, I just added a few of the, I would say maybe like a tablespoon, two tablespoons of the uncooked rice on the inside, um, and then you can seal it up, and I'll show you what that sounds like. I would say it also might be a good idea to maybe glue the outside or tape it um, so that your top doesn't come off. Mine's a little bit loose, um, but this is what it sounds like when it's finished. That sounds pretty close to a traditional maraca. Then for my second Easter egg, I just filled the bottom of it with some beads and then you can close the top here. Um, again, depending on what kind of egg you've got, um, this one seals a little bit easier, but you might want to tape it or glue it. Um, but this is what this guy sounds like as our little maraca using beads, so you can see it's definitely a different sound. All right, and finally, I poured some of the uncooked rice into my Gatorade bottle. Ideally, yours would be decorated. Um, if you wanted to do that, it would be a lot cuter. Um, but I poured some rice in the bottom of my Gatorade jar. Um, through the magic of editing, you did not see the giant mess that I made on my table. So you might want to get the help of a parent um, or an older person or to use a funnel. Um, but anyway, that is my suggestion um, but make sure to seal your top and again you've got a nice little easy DIY maraca so hopefully you guys had fun there's the other two there so they all sound uh, pretty similar and kind of like the traditional maraca so hopefully you had fun and you're able to make a couple maracas of your own. Uh, we'd love to see your pictures so you can always email them to info at gswestok.org and show yours off. Thanks we'll see you next time.